In this video, we're going to be ordering integers. Now, using a number line is going to help you decide if this, this integer is the smallest, is it the farthest on the left side, or is it large, is it further on the right side of the number line. So if you don't have a number line that goes this far, you're going to have to start thinking of it mentally. Does this go even further down the right side or even further down the left side? So this one's asking us to order them from least to greatest, from the smallest number to the largest number. Number lines go from smallest to largest, so this could be a really easy one to help you with. So let's look at our numbers. We have negative 38, 84, negative 79, and 33. The number that would be the farthest to the left is going to be negative 79. Our numbers, if we start at 0, go negative 1, negative 2, negative 3, they get larger as they go to the left. So the bigger looking that number is, when it has a negative in front of it, it means it's actually the smallest. It's kind of a reverse way of thinking. So after negative 79 would come negative 38. Negative 38 starts to get closer to zero. Now we're on the positive side, so we can start thinking how we normally think. The next number after zero would be 33. And then after that would come 84. So we have our smallest value to our largest value. Let's look at one that goes from greatest to least. This is not the way a number line is organized, so it's going to be a little bit trickier. So I want to go from the biggest number, the one that's the farthest to the right on the number line, to the smallest number. So starting with my largest number, I know I'm going to look for something that's positive. Nope, maybe, nope, maybe, nope, nope, nope. Maybe. So my positive numbers are 17, 2, and 1. Well, 17 is the biggest. And then I have 2. Then I have 1. And 0, of course, is going to always be in the middle of the greatest to least. Okay, now I'm getting smaller and smaller and smaller. So from 0, what will be the next number moving left on that number line? would be negative 2, because we have 0, negative 1, negative 2, negative 3, negative 4, negative 5, negative 6, and then negative 11, and finally negative 15. Negative 15 is our smallest because it is the farthest to the left on a number line. 17 is the largest because it's farthest to the right on a number line, right? The number line always goes least to greatest, so when we're ordering from greatest to least, we kind of have to switch our thinking.